Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh Hi everyone Come back to Amelia Putri And then this time I will present one of the material from the biology course Namely protozoa Okay, here for discussion that I will discuss the first definition of protozoa, this con the characteristic of protozoa, and the last body shape of protozoa, and the later the classification of protozoa. Okay, without further ado, let's jump right to the discussion definition of protozoa. Protozoa derived from the Greek word protos means first and zoo means animal. Okay, that was the presentation of the definition of protozoa. Next, I will discuss the characteristic of protozoa. Okay, the first measuring 3 100 microns, two live in watery place, three one cell, four the personal membrane walls and then reproduce sexually and asexually vision and body okay next i will explain the body shape of protozoa okay the body shape of protozoa consists of number one ball number two round elongated number three like sandals and then irregular shape Next, we will enter the classification of protozoa. Number one, Rhizopoda or Sarcodina, derived from the word rhizo, meaning slow, and podos, meaning foot. The feature move with artificial ecos locomotion and foot predators. Example, Arcella vulgaris. Okay, number two, Vegelets or Mastigopera. Derived from the word flagrum meaning with feather. Next, the feature number one, uniseer. Number two, autotrophs or heterotrophs. Number three, generally parasitic. Number four, move with the flagellum by swimming. And the later, reproduce accessually. An example, trypanosoma. Number three, cilia are in fusoria. Cilia are tiny heads and are the means of locomotion. Number one, habitat in fresh water. Number two, sharp sandals. And number three, reproduce asexually. Example, didinium nesidum. Number four, sporozoa. Sporozoa derived from the word spore. We mean set and zoo means animal. Okay, the feature number one do not have locomotion so that sporozoa are weary that the right one animals and humans. Number two, reproduce by sexual binary fission and asexual union of gametes. An example, Plasmodium vivax. Okay, that's enough of my presentation for today and then thank you for all the attention. Akhirul kalam, wassalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh.